Hello and welcome to this Team Expansion Core Training video series. I'm Doug Lucas and in this first video, Core Training 101, we'll look at Team Expansion's purpose, mission, and vision. First, Team Expansion's purpose. Our purpose is multiplying disciples and churches among the unreached. We want to be a disciple worth multiplying and in that way, God can work through us to call others around us to follow him. And then they can start spreading the good news to their friends and family as well and help in the advancement of his kingdom. Our mission begins with this phrase, born out of extraordinary prayer. We actually began in a prayer meeting in a dorm room way back in 1978 in a college in eastern Kentucky. What do we try to do? We partner with the global church. That means not only are we sent out by churches in our homeland, but also we work together with churches around the world to try to spread the good news so that we can fulfill Jesus' prayer in John 17. What are we trying to do? To mobilize, train, and coach qualified workers. So we're trying to find the best of the best kingdom workers to recruit them and then to train them and coach them to maximum effectiveness. And the direction we feel called by God to go is in the implementation of these fruitful practices. By that we mean the best practices that will cause the kingdom not only to add new workers, but to actually multiply into new groups. And that's what we're looking for, the best practices of church planting movements. Some people refer to this as disciple-making movements. To us, it's all the same. The idea is that groups will multiply, and that by doing that, God's kingdom can grow. And that's our vision. We'd like to see 24 disciple-making movements by the end of 2024. And what we mean by disciple-making movement is that there would be four streams that would go at least four generations deep by the end of that year in 24 different places. Now, picture yourself in one of those places. Picture yourself trying to find a person or a group to act as someone like Paul in 2 Timothy 2.2. That person or group would then call Timothys, individuals or groups that would act just like Timothy did. And just like Paul told him to try to find reliable men, reliable people who will also be qualified to teach others, pretty soon you'll see that we will have four layers deep in those four places. And that would be one disciple-making movement by the end of that year. That's our goal is to try to have 24 of those going. That's our goal in Team Expansion. We hope you'll join us either through prayer, partnership, joining us maybe, and going with us, or by sending us. Find out more on the web at www.teamexpansion.org. Thanks for listening.